NASA's Lunar Atmosphere and Dust Environment Explorer, or LADEE spacecraft, is in orbit around the moon and is ready to start collecting data for science operations. Three, two, one, zero ignition, and liftoff of Avatar 5 with LADEE. After a successful launch on September 6th at NASA's Wallops Flight Facility, the spacecraft began its journey by orbiting the Earth with increasingly larger circles called phasing loops to propel it towards the moon. 30 days later, LADEE Mission Operations Flight Controllers executed thruster burns and maneuvers to slow the spacecraft so it could be caught by the moon's gravity. Once in orbit around the moon, LADEE began several weeks of diagnostics to prepare the spacecraft for science operations. The LADEE spacecraft carries three science instruments on board. The neutral mass spectrometer will take what are called in situ or in place measurements of the atmosphere of the moon. The ultraviolet invisible light spectrometer will take remote measurements of both the atmosphere and dust from a distance. The third instrument is the lunar dust experiment. It will directly measure dust particles and analyze their masses. During this preliminary phase of the mission, a new technology was successfully tested with a fourth instrument called the Lunar Laser Communications Demonstration. This is NASA's first high data rate laser communication system used on a deep space mission. It will enable communications similar to the capabilities found in high speed fiber optic networks. Built at NASA Ames Research Center, the spacecraft will collect data on the behavior of the extremely thin atmosphere or exosphere of the moon. The team is very excited about the science mission starting. That's, that's kind of what everything is being done for, is to get the science data. And so everybody's excited to, to see that actually start. LADEE is ready to begin gathering data to help scientists understand the fragile lunar exosphere and its behavior before robotic and astronaut activity returns to the surface at some point in the future.